गाइस दिस इज अनमिता वर्मा टुडे वी हैव हियर डॉक्टर राजू इंदकुली ही इज अ प्रोफेसर इन फाइनेंस एंड अ मैन विद अ लॉट ऑफ नॉलेज टुडे वी आर हियर टू गेन सम नॉलेज एंड सम एडवाइजर्स फ्रॉम हिम सो लेट्स हैव अ टॉक हेलो सर हाय हाउ आर यू डूइंग आई एम गुड हाउ आर यू सर ग्रेट या आई एम बेसिकली परस्यूइंग माय इंजीनियरिंग बीटेक इंजीनियरिंग in our university civil in the branch civil okay so as uh, for if, uh, if i look at further opportunities like masters is what strikes to my mind mm-hmm. it's uh, it's the uh, basic way i want to get into uh, so i'm i'm here to like ask few things about it uh, what is masters in fact see uh, we need to put a question why are you doing uh, your btech why are you doing your under graduation okay so when you put your question to yourself uh, that way you will get an answer okay so from there you can decide on whether to do your masters further or not the idea of getting into this education system is to make yourself uh, self dependent with your own earnings get a job do business and so on so when you are clear about said you said uh, you are doing btech civil engineering right yeah. why did you get into this no you need to be honest yeah uh, i have been curious about like construction so are you sure yeah or uh, you just appeared for some uh, interest examination you got the rank there was no choice it was option no are you sure yeah okay uh, good to hear that because usually Uh, people go for uh, mset uh, or other common entrance examination tests and based on their best rank computer science if not some mechanical uh, you know chemical engineering whatever right that depends on that year whichever is uh, highly demanded i appreciate uh, you always wanted to be a civil engineer you wanted to be a civil engineer and join or you are interested in knowing uh, civil engineering I was basically interested in civil, uh, like to know what it was. Okay. It didn't start with being a civil engineering first. At least, yeah. yeah again, I appreciate that. Uh, so you are not worried about your career, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. So uh, you are not looking yourself uh, to be a civil engineer. Yeah. So civil engineering as a subject was exciting to you. Yeah. You wanted to know more about it. Okay. So please understand. Don't uh, spend your uh, precious time for your excitement interest knowledge and so on if you want all those things wikipedia is there youtube is there okay free ebooks are there you can do that yeah. but uh, always uh, to all the youngsters uh, who are pursuing the the tenth to or whatever when you get into undergraduation you should be sure on uh, why you are choosing bcom or bsc or engineering or btech or whatever that's that is very very important okay don't go with a gut feeling or parents advice or neighbors advice or friends advice seniors it doesn't work mm-hmm. so i think you're asking about your masters right yeah. so once your undergraduation uh, intentions are clear then you will think about uh, you you said you're in third year right yeah okay so you want to get into masters yeah uh You don't want to get into a job. Right now, I want to pursue a higher education rather than doing a job. So why so? Gain more knowledge. So learning. again, you are you are giving you are getting in the same line, right? So you join BTEC for knowledge. Huh? Again, it is still exciting. Dig deeper. You want to get into uh, a PG, a masters. Okay. See, persons who are maybe you are that kind of a person. people who uh, 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 craze of acquiring knowledge they are they are suitable for research or teaching yeah. okay maybe you are of that kind okay if that is the case you do masters then pursue your phd program then get into teaching okay research does not mean only teaching you can also get into research uh, careers a lot of industries are entertaining uh, research candidates okay so that way yeah for your masters i suggest yeah your own mtech is there yeah. go through gate and other requirements i think you you know it better than me yeah yeah, yeah. like uh, what if 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 i don't want to like uh, uh, extend uh, pursue my masters in my uh, specified branch you know 
the other uh, masters like uh, business administration mba and all like how about that uh, okay you mean to say uh, instead of mtech you want to get into mba yeah again why i ask you that because uh, um, rather than uh, being into a technical field other knowledge vertical no <laughs> <laughs> Uh, rather than being in a technical field, I want to divert my field into business uh, management kind of thing. So, no. See again, that's a that's a wrong way of uh, doing a master's. Again, killing two more years. That don't do that. Okay. See, you, uh, I already answered. If you want to get into M Tech, no, you will fit into uh, uh, academic fraternity kind of uh, groups, or uh, maybe you want to get into research also. But you want to diversify. There's nothing wrong doing an MBA. I'm not saying don't do it, or any PG if you're qualified. Okay, but why? Why you should do it, right? Say for example, you do MBA, you get uh, wealth of knowledge and management over. Then what? You will do one more masters. Then where is the end for this? So that you have to be very clear. Okay, maybe I uh, don't stop your excitement. Uh, yeah, you can. Get into MBA if you like to. After your uh, maybe MS is also an option. M Tech, MS, MBA. Yeah. No one can stop you. Yeah. Yes, you can definitely do it. Okay. Like uh, I see many of my uh, friends being interested in MBA rather than M Tech. I don't know why, but uh, like. So it's your friends or you? <laughs> <laughs> it's me too. Okay. Um, so uh, why, uh, like, why, uh, like, why specifically, uh, specifically MBA? I mean, uh, what distinguishes that from the other masters? See, if you want to do M Tech, you need to be a B Tech or B. If you want to do if you want to do some other student wants to do msc he or she should be bsc a person who wants to do mcom the person should be having bcom but in case of mba anyone can do mba why like that okay so management is a different uh, discipline okay uh, it is not taught in your school it is not uh, taught in your undergraduation so first time you are uh, learning about management skills that's the reason institutions and colleges which are offering a, a masters in management they are known as business schools or b schools okay. this is the reason why because for the first time for everyone a science student art student architecture student engineering student technology student uh, whoever even a mbbs student they can get into management for the first time they'll be learning about management so why management means uh, if you start your own business of course management is of great help you will get different verticals you will learn uh, you will acquire different skills importantly how to make decision okay your decision making skills will be very sharp and within no time you have to make it quick and it, it should be uh, cost and time effective that you will learn that will be a one year program a two years or three year program you will be going through all the subjects or courses or whatever uh, uh, credits you have okay you will be going through them but at the end of the program you will be a different person you will be at a different level that's why people look at uh, uh, mba program okay okay now i get it uh, like when one prefers MBA, mm. like are there certain institutions or uh, any kind of uh, universities which you need to like uh, be in for uh, having a quality uh, education? See again in India or here, uh, uh, I don't know how do you take it. Uh, everyone uh, aims at IIMs, crack cat. Get into IIM. If it is not IIM, some other even within IIMs ranking and other things, you know, the matter. Other apart from IIMs, there are private B schools that are also there. They also get ranked. You try to choose the best, okay. And if they are not there, you try to get into state uh, common entrance tests. Crack that in Andhra, you have M set. In Telangana, you have T set. Okay. Similarly, in West Bengal, Delhi. 
Tamil Nadu, Karnataka, we have different entrances. So you try to get into the campus, university campus. You don't get anything, then you get into affiliated college or some autonomous B schools. That is how, that is the hierarchy. So I think I not tell you that. <laughs> yeah. Everyone uh, hopes for the best. It is not that I want to do something very specific offered by some B school in say, uh, for example, uh, uh, maybe Vizag or some B school is uh, offering something very good in Kolkata, you know. We don't look at that kind of a match, okay. We look at the institution's brand, we look at uh, placement uh, background, placement history, average pay, <laughs> average package, you know, that is the tag, <laughs> average package is this. So accordingly you try to choose it. I don't think uh, you need to break your head on that. They break your head for cash. <laughs> yeah? If you are successful, yeah, you get the best institute. Yeah. But it is very important, but if you are very specific, say for example, BTEC computer science guy. Mm -hmm. uh, here she is looking to excel in uh, uh, fintech or cryptocurrency kind of thing. Then that person will definitely look at uh, which IIT college or which IIM uh, is offering or which premium B school is offering that kind of a program. Mm -hmm. A specialization or a few set of courses in that. Yeah. Similarly, uh, an engineer may be looking for supply chain or operations management. You know, So a pure, uh, a highly technical guy, quant guy, okay, rich in mathematics, maybe he'll love to play with numbers. They want to do uh, stock market numbers, equity analysis, derivatives kind of thing. So that kind of a search is always there. Mm -hmm. Each and every institution is diversifying. It's not that all the institutions offer all the specializations and all the courses, not at all. Mm -hmm. You can definitely search for that. And that happens if you have a better rank. Yeah. If you get a better score or rank, then you got the choice. Mm -hmm. If you don't have the choice, just accept whatever you get it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I, I think I could figure this out soon. Yeah. <laughs> it's great talking to you. Thank you very much. For My pleasure.